continue with a uh, blizzard warning. And as you can see, that will be central Oklahoma, includes most of the Oklahoma City area, about down to Chickasha, but you know, still water heated and such, and then on into Tulsa. These red areas out in here indicate near blizzard. Uh, in central Oklahoma, you won't be able to see where you're going, and in these red areas, you'll almost be able to see where you're going. So it's that kind of deal. It looks like blizzard, a near blizzard situation all across the state. And uh, that'll be later tonight. Right now, precipitation continues to develop. Eventually, these storms, these are thunderstorms, will come up over the cold air in central Oklahoma, and we'll end up with freezing rain. Uh, it could be, you know, quite ugly. In fact, we'll just do it this way. We see by 1 a.m., this is freezing rain, this is sleet. It's as far north as I-40, uh, from Clinton to Oklahoma City over to Okima. And really, for that period through 3, 3 a.m., a mix of uh, snow, uh, freezing rain, sleet in central Oklahoma. The blue is the snow. And the snow increases by 7 a.m. And even though it's showing mainly sleet and, and sleet and freezing rain in the Oklahoma City area, I would think that there's going to be a lot of snow mixed in with that. Very strong winds, 20 to 40, gusts to 50. By 10 a.m., it's a, it's a raging blizzard in central Oklahoma, north central sections. A lot of freezing rain and sleet to our east. It looks like by 3 p.m., it's still snowing here in central Oklahoma. It's going to end rather quickly. But even though it ends late on Tuesday, you know, the wind will be up and uh, the snow will continue to drift. So it looks like to me on Tuesday, most of the roads will be closed. Uh, the wind, the wind chills will be down as low as 15 degrees below zero. And the uh, actual temperature tomorrow night, about 5. So a really uh, significant winter storm. And it looks like uh, we will get back above freezing about Friday. How's that?